Hello, this is Otter Bricks and Films going with my brand new Lego video today. Today, this is part six of the collaboration project. So this week we have um, mostly just built and film. That's literally all we did. Um, we built the set, filmed it, took it down. So yeah, we did the beachfront area. We filmed that underwater area. We haven't filmed that, but yeah, let's jump into it right now. Hello, this is Otter Bricks and Films. And I'm coming to you with another video. So, yep, I just left off, or we just left off with the, this section, like, sort of complete. But now I need to rip out part of this hill to add in the cave section. So let's do that right now. So currently I have finished the little cave entrance. It does look like, um, or it does look a little bad, but I will try to fix it up. While I'm, while I'm building this hill. Currently it is oh, 8.50. So yeah, let's get to work. So currently I'm about to take down the cave scene. And this is pretty sad because this is actually my favorite set that I've ever built for uh, the collaboration project or craft. So it's sad to see this go. but So currently I've already taken down I've completely taken down the cave section and as you can see this is one of my base plates right here and all these part bins are pretty much everything that comprise the cave a lot of gray a lot of gray bricks but this is going to fuel this over here the next project over here let's check what time it is and, oh geez it's it's three right there but yeah but yeah, let's get back to work. So this is the current progress on the build of this section right here. And as, as you can see last time, the hills are much taller. So yeah. Also I built, or I think I showed you this, the cave section over here. So yeah. And I'm actually planning to do a hallway like back through here. And yeah, this probably will be covered up. I'm not sure, probably not though, but yeah, I'm going to get back to work. What time is it? 3.23. So, yeah. So, I just wanted to show you the progress on um, this section so far. And I have completed this back cave section. So, yeah. I just wanted to kind of have this because, honestly, if I didn't have it, it wouldn't look as natural. And I think this is a... Pretty good shot to have the stop motion in. Also, I'm going to have the green plates going um, going overhead here, too. And yes, I'm going to be covering um, these 16 by 16 plates up with green plates. So, yeah. What time is it? 8.49. Probably should go to bed. So, currently, right now, I have finished placing all the ground or the plates for the ground here on the project so far so yeah that's very good next I'm going to work on the elevation area here probably not going to do it there but yeah let's get started also this is probably going to be the thumbnail of the video <laughs> but yeah let's get to work so currently, I think this section right here is pretty much done. I added a little bit more height for the cave right here. I think that just adds a little bit more detail. And honestly, I think it looks a lot better. So yeah, now I just have to work on the ocean. What time is it? 528. Let's get working. So this is the current progress on the set so far. I have worked all, or I've pretty much used used up all my blue bricks to complete the ocean. So yeah, I still have to finish up this base plate here. So yeah, just a little bit. Probably go to the Lego store soon to get all those pieces. I also added some details on top of here, which looks pretty good. Anyways, I've got to go to bed. It's 9.28, and it's my bedtime. See ya. 
So currently, right now, I'm about to start the underwater section right here. It's going to be two base plates, just two sand base plates right there. And my current inspiration for it is this actual <laughs> Lego magazine. So you can see all this colorf colorful marine life all around it. So I'm going to probably use this as inspiration for the build. Maybe not as detailed as this, but, you know, still detailed like that. I also just put the other model over here. Still going to have to get more green, or no, sorry, not green, blue bricks to finish up the ocean. So yeah, let's get back to work. So this is the current progress on the underwater area. I've sh or I've showed you part of the cave here, and I've completely finished that. And I've also finished this um, section right here. And then I'm gonna and then I'm going to finish the wraparound right here. And that will hopefully be it for the rock work. I'll <coughs> excuse me, but yeah, I do like I actually do like doing rock work so but yeah also put some more maybe some more rock formations um in the middle as well to just to spice it up but yeah let's jump into the time lapse i've pretty much set it up right there so yeah ju let's jump into the time lapse so as you can see from the time lapse i've completed this um rock work from the under for the underwater area now it is get or now it is time to start work on the little um rock formations in the middle so yeah let's do that right now So currently I just got back from the Lego store and I bought one pab cup or pick a brick or pick and build. But yeah, let's see what's inside this um, pab cup. So I put the camera on a tripod or tripod to get the full um, glimpse or shot of the pab cup being opened. And there we go. Oh, jeez, this is a lot of parts. A lot of, um, just mostly just blue bricks here. Because I really do need blue bricks for the ocean part. And we've got some of these, um, sapling pieces. Right. And if we get the camera to focus. Oh. Yeah, right there. We've also got some snot here. Cylinder pieces. And overall, just a pretty good haul. Let's take a little closer, or let's take a closer look at these parts. Okay, so yeah, as we can see at the top layer, we have mostly blue bricks. I did actually stack these to um, fit more in the cup. So like the sideways here, so... Yeah, like I uh, showed you, we've got the snot. What else we got? got? These little, oh, got these. One by one. There. Um, we have a cylinder pieces here. That's pretty cool. Some plate, some gray plates. Even got some fire pieces. Yeah, overall, just a pretty good, um, pick a brick. I just try to fill, or I try to fill this up to the absolute brim because, yeah, well, I needed some parts. <laughs> but, yeah. This will go mostly towards the cloud project. Well, oh, mo like, literally all these blue bricks 
we'll go to the ocean over here. And I, I really hope this is enough. I kind of feel like it's not. But, yeah, we'll just have to see. Well, the worst thing happened. I'm out of blue bricks. So yeah. But honestly, with the blue bricks that I did buy, I did get a pretty good chunk of it done. I think I ended right there, so. It was actually a pretty good. Oh geez, I almost dropped the phone. But yeah, I only have like a couple more. Probably have to do only do a few more layers of that so yeah pretty good progress i hope you like the time lapse so this is my current progress on the underwater area and i think it is looking pretty good i've been adding a lot of details to this place especially with all the new um parts that i did get from the pick a brick wall they can see all the flowers that I've used and all of those pieces, like those um, sprout pieces. And overall, it looks pretty good. The, the two main pieces I'm using for detail are these like little uh, flower pieces here. And the little sprout piece here. And I think these are looking, or I think these are pretty good for underwater areas. Or just some foliage in general. But yeah, that's my progress on the underwater area so far okay so this is all that i can do for the underwater section i do not have any more blue bricks i am not joking like this is like all that i do have so i'm gonna have to buy some more so i i'm actually not too far off i probably probably like uh four or five layers of this or of this and it should be good also in the meantime i'm going to get the areas it the um, like the area set up on this table or these tables to actually start brick filming so yeah let's do that right now so i just set up the new um st studio so far for the um the next scene and i'm currently using the phone that i'm actually going to use to start filming so yeah this is the lighting situation so the two lamps and this is going to be probably the first shot, something like that. But anyways, I have the tripod set up there too. And the two lamps. And then we're going to set up the poster board, this blue one. Then I also have the power strip here to give all the power to it. And I also have a note that says, do not press the red button. Right there. No one pressed that. But yeah, that's the um, studio so far for the next set. Let's get filming. Hello, we've actually got the set um, pretty much ready for production. It's actually been like a week since I have actually filmed a clip. Since I... Well, I've been just doing other stuff, so let's just do a full run through. So the first shot is going to be down here with the tripod. We're also going to have the two lights here and they're right there. So yeah, we also have the heel there. We're not going to be showing this, so that so that's why it's all colorful. And but I could um, fix it up, but never mind. We also have the lights on the pick a brick cups, as you see. Most of them are taped down. We have the outlet here, basically. More lights here. Here is just like the place stuff here, but. And we've got the two poster boards. So behind it is basically whatever we can, um, whatever, whatever we have to hold it up, like these plastic bins. I also have to have fishy line running down to hold this up. That's pretty funny. But yeah, that's pretty much it for the 
um, studio here right now. Let's get the filming. Let's actually get the filming. So yeah. Well, that's a wrap. So currently I finished up filming this section right here. And I think it took two or three days. It should have taken or taken like um probably like one day at least or no. Probably like one or two days, but kinda dragged it out. Wasn't feeling a little bit motivated. But nevertheless we have actually completed it. Next scene I am will be probably shooting is the underwater area right here. Probably do that tomorrow and start taking down this set. Nice job, crew. Well, it's only me. Right now, we are about to take down this set. Let's do that right now. And that's going to do it for the video. Thanks for watching, and this is Otter Bricks and Films. Bye bye